I'll get right to the point. Please do. Mari, hey. Yeah, hi. You, uh, you have Stanfield, right? Mm -hmm. He's your client? Yeah, him and his people. Well, I have some stuff straight from the grand jury that you're going to want to see sooner rather than later. Is this a Title III case? You're going to find it interesting, I promise. All right. When can you meet? Uh, tomorrow, after work. Yeah. Same money, right? Yeah, the money's the same. Good. We can grand jury Gary Di Pasquale tomorrow, along with that one-party consent call. Or, here's the deal. No court trials. Bartlow pleads to all the bodies in the vacants and takes life. No parole. We'd want the second shooter, too, but Pearson's beyond that now. Metcalf and Wagstaff plead to possession with intent. Stanfield takes 10 years on conspiracy. You're blackmailing an officer of the court. The moment you came in here and offered that quid pro quo, you were guilty of obstruction of justice. You're right. I could get six to eight years. And for bribery of a state's attorney and the violation of grand jury secrecy, you could see 10 to 12. I'll be out a couple years before you, Maury. You come home, first round's on me, I guess. So you'll let me walk to keep this case out of open court? The file must be dirty as hell, huh? The conspiracy charge on Stanfield falls without the cell phones, and you and I both know that if someone does some digging, they're gonna find an illegal wiretap, and you're gonna lose the phones. Everhart, 274, Maryland, 459, or Ciccolini, 435, U.S. 268. Lying cops don't automatically kill a case. But that's a lot of risk on appeal. And a lot of dirt for your office to show. No. You're scared of the light. Partlow takes his chances on the legit murder charge only. The conspiracy count goes, and Stanfield and the rest walk. Stanfield walks, but the case goes on the stead docket. Not dismissed outright. And although I can tell you there are people in this city who can't tolerate a scandal at this particular moment, that dynamic changes after November. Elections. After November, no one is going to care as much about showing dirt. If Carcetti wins, he's in Annapolis. If he loses, he's an incumbent mayor who can take a hit or two. So you tell Mr. Stanfield that this is his only window. Partlow pleads to all the murders, and both lieutenants plead to the drugs. Then Stanfield retires. He's done. We even get the scent of him on the street ever again. This case comes off stat and goes to trial. And if we have to put a few cops in jail right behind him, so be it. We'll bring the evidence and take a hit. The client walks away now. Or the both of you don't walk at all. <laughs>